Welcome to Tokyo Saurus. So what's up in Japan? A video tweet was posted a few days ago by Komai underscore JP, who is also a streamer on YouTube and Twitch, and has since gotten 166,000 retweets and 224,000 likes. The video is a two-minute stream of him playing H1Z1, King of the Hill, where he met a player from Miami and the two became bros. But as with all good stories, it ended off tragically. Before we dive into the actual story though, let's just give you a quick overview of what H1Z1 is all about to give you a bit of context. Basically, it's a battle royale with up to 150 players where they are dropped onto a big map where they will find weapons and gear to kill each other. It's a game of survival where if you last to the last 10 people standing, you can either choose to win as a group or try to kill the remaining players and win as a single player to get a bigger prize. The most notable feature of these battle royale games is the fact that voice communication is enabled and you can hear or talk to people that are close to you. So often people can sometimes negotiate ways to survive when cornered or more often than not just used as a tool of harassment. But back to the viral video. It started with Komai, the guy who made the video. He started shooting at a player that pretty much had no items. Komai on the other hand was pretty decked out with lots of ammo and items already and Komai quartered him to a rock. The other player said hi, and Komai asked him where he was from, to which he answered, Miami. Komai then starts referring to him as Miami. Komai then told him goodbye, which meant he was going to spare him. Komai also told him he was from Japan, and the other player responded, Oh dude, I love Japan. And this is how love stories start. Komai drops him a few items, and romantic J-pop starts playing in the background. Later, the two meet up again by chance, and this time, Miami looks much more geared and actually gives Komai an item, and the two part ways again. And in the final part, we see Komai engaged in battle, and the inevitable happens as he is killed by another player. But suddenly, out of nowhere, we see Miami run onto the battlefield with little regard for his own life, and yells, You killed Japan! Japan obviously referring to Komai, just as Komai refers to him as Miami. But sadly, he gets downed in just a few seconds and loses his own life as well. This was followed by a dark letter of grievance by Komai which read, He and I will probably never meet again. However, I'm certain that he will also be thinking about me. Even though we will never meet in real life, we have become friends already. So turns out this got so big on Twitter that people actually found the Miami guy, who turned out was also looking for Komai. Whoever said you can't find true love on the internet, this, this is what you show them boys. There is even fan art dedicated to the two's bromance getting attention on Twitter. For those of you interested, Komai has his own YouTube streaming channel you can check out in the link below. And obviously, a link to the Twitter post will also be in the description below. So, what did you think of this H1Z1 bromance? As usual, let me know in the comments below. Thumbs up the video if you liked it and follow Tokyosaurus on social media for Japanese culture tweets and video updates. And make sure you're subscribed so you can get the latest things people are talking about in Japan right in your inbox. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.